new game. Easy difficulty. Previous data will be removed. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, I'm so nervous. Alright, let's do this. As soon as I have character control, that's when I'm starting the timer. As soon as I have character control. I gotta remember to do my splits as well. Alright. We are live. Check the terrace. I don't think we actually have to use our inventory buttons. We also probably don't have to run around the entire outside of the terrace. Cancel the incoming call. Here we go. Alright. Our first split... is the Rudolph note, I believe. Turn that off. Turn this off. And then he says, hey, let's go back upstairs. And then there's a Rudolph note. And that's our first split. And now we go downstairs and we turn on the... Well, no, we need the flashlight first. Flashlight first. Oh, call my parents. Dang it. Dang it. Ah, I'm forgetting the route. Then the flashlight. Find flashlight. It's supposed to be right here. Oh, is it random spawn? Flashlight's a random spawn. Interesting. I didn't know that. Okay. Good to know. Alright, Rudolph is trucking around now. So we need to watch out for him. I also should be counting my sprint breaths better than I am. But it's gonna be fine. Alright, I do believe there's supposed to be a note on the ground right here, isn't there? What's our objective? Come on, what's our objective? Do we have to equip the flashlight? Alright, so we're definitely losing a lot of time here, which is good because that means we have space to improve. There we go. Alright, elf note. Good. And now, water gun in the shed. So we have to, I hate this, but we have to access the door to the shed before we can go in and find the key in the kitchen. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, three, four, five. Okay. Hi, Rudolph. Thank you for forgetting me immediately. That's really convenient for us. key. Alright, let's go ahead and equip it now. Well, we know Rudolph's not behind us. Oh, there's the elf sound. Two, three, four, five. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Don't like that Rudolph already knows that we're in here. That's pretty inconvenient, actually. Grab that, and then, oh, we don't actually need a note there. I think we're going to equip the water gun, just to play safe for us this time, just because we are new to this. All right, we need to get to the gaze bow. Hello, elf. Do that. We're losing a lot of time, but again, I think that's a good thing, because that means that we can improve. We also need to find the optimal route through the gazebo. Because I don't believe that was it. This doesn't connect, does it? Dang it! Ah, dang it! The other thing I was just saying about optimal routes, this was not it. Alright, 
Should be the Krampus note. Boom. That split was a little late on that split, but it's fine. So Krampus is active now. We just have to go in and call our parents, and then we survive the night. There's the elf. I go around this way. I need to be counting. I've not been doing a good job at that. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Hello, Rudolph. That was a dumb move of me, but whatever, it worked out. I should probably put another split there for the phone call. I think there should be an in-between split. That was foolish of me. Alright, where is Krampus? There's the elf. Has he seen us? I want to get past him. At this point... It doesn't really matter how we survive or what we do to survive. Okay, the elf knows we're here. All that matters is that we do survive. We have a secret that if we can... Why is the door locked? We have a secret that if we can if we can activate this glitch, we're gonna, we're, it's just going to be a piece of cake. But we have to activate the glitch. I don't think we need another split there, it's fine. It's probably fine without it. Alright, activate the glitch. I need to get consistent with this glitch as well. Yeah, I hear you big guy. Come on glitch. Come on glitch. Come on, Glitch. Come on, Glitch. Oh, come on, Glitch. Boom. All right. We're good. So we're done with the house. That's part one. Oh. I thought Krampus was going to turn that corner there for a minute. That had me nervous. Hey guys. How are you doing? All right. So there's a lot of spots we could save a little bit of time, but that's not, that's not bad. We're not bad at this point. 54 seconds to get to Rudolph, 2 minutes 25 to get to the Elf, etc, etc. We could add another split when we answer the phone, but the more I'm having to take my hand off the mouse, uh, I, I guess I could move my start-stop to a thumb button on the mouse, but I don't know. I don't know. I'll think about that. I use those buttons in other games, so I don't, I don't really want to mess anything up, but if all I'm doing is running this game, it doesn't matter. Twelve thirty-five. Get comfortable. This is the easiest part of the run. As long as we don't do something ridiculous to mess it up. Easy is definitely easier, and the difficulty definitely is uh, related directly to when the enemies are interested in you, and when they're not. Oh, okay, so the PV... The personal best on the timer that we have is just showing my personal best for this section. And like this versus my personal best. Okay, that's cool. Oh, jerks. They killed the power. Hello, Rudolph. We could just jump off the world during this part of the run. We could just, just absolutely jump off the world. 
I'm just worried that with that causing so much character lag, not in-game lag from what I can tell, but character lag, I'm nervous that that would also cause, uh, like, skipped frames. So it won't go to 2 a.m. as quickly, right? Because if the game is counting 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, but then it skips on 10, so it's, or it skips on 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 8, 8, 9, 10, we lose time. I don't know, that's speculation. It probably would be fine because the game doesn't visibly lag at all. So if there's no stutter, there's no stutter. But I don't really want to tempt it if I don't have to. Hi, puppy. You're okay. Good girl. That's a good girl. Go back to sleep. Hi, Krampus. You gonna see us? You gonna see us, buddy? No? No? Okay, that's fine. Oh, there he is. Hello! The goat man himself. No, oh, he lost interest. I understand why he's here. We are definitely naughty for floating above the world and breaking physics, etc. I understand. I get it. We don't have our route perfectly planned for uh, the next area. We Just now when we tested it, we found out that you can go through doors that enemies open, even if they're locked for you. So you can skip a few things that way if you get really good luck. Like if a nutcracker opens a door and you're able to sprint past him to somewhere that you need to be. However, for this run, I think we are going to not do that. Because I'm not yet confident enough in my own ability to avoid the enemies. Like if I get a nutcracker on me, it's easy difficulty, so we'd probably be totally fine. But I don't want to risk the getting caught time sink so instead we will run through that part the legitimate way unlike this hello little confused elf you're okay buddy I'm going to forget a doorway again when we get to the next, uh, once we're in the dungeon. Especially where that school kid shows up, sitting at the desk with the witch drawing. I have to make sure, I assume it's a witch drawing, I don't really know, I can't tell. Uh, but I have to make sure that I remember that the door is in that dark corner. Because we're not going to pick up the flashlight, it's not worth our time. Even though it is right next to the other items, it's just not worth it. We are going to pick up the squirt gun because I'm weak and we might need it in the finale. We might do a run, like, later on, just for fun. Not today, but later on, just for fun, where we don't pick up any items that are unnecessary. Because I think you have to pick up the toy gun in this intro, the flashlight and the toy gun in this intro, to cue the next bits. But in the dungeon, it doesn't seem like it matters that much. Theoretically, we're close now, right? Yeah, we're almost there. Oh, we definitely don't need to add another split in between the Krampus note and 2 a.m. Because if we did, it would just be wasted time, right? Because once you activate the phone, as long as you don't die, your time's going to be the same there until someone can figure out how to sequence break the game. So it doesn't matter, we don't need it at all. What was that clink sound? Did anyone else hear that? Hi. 
Hello. Poor little goat. Why does he have human feet? I hate that. Look at his feet. Where are the human feet? Oh, I've never noticed that. You're not even a goat man, other than the horns. You're just some random dude that's kidnapping children. This game is so much darker now. Look at his feet! Oh, how did I not notice that before now? <laughs> I like the way Rudolph prances around. One might say that he's a prancer and dancer and and Vixen? Comet? I've missed a few. Blitzen? <laughs> Alright, there's 2 a.m. It was bad split timing on me. I I should have hit that earlier. Oh, we're still going, but I can't skip this. Okay. Hello, I am a rookie. Can you tell? Okay. Now we check the note. And we move this. There we go. There we go. Oop. Uh, I'm a professional. Can you tell? Ah, oh, dang it. Eh. Alright, so we're gonna sprint around here. How easy is easy mode going to be? So, I have an audio bug, by the way. I have no game sound. Which is really bad for this. Dang it, Ah, oh. Will the game sound fix? Because I need my audio cues. Apparently we skipped the cutscene too quickly. Nope. Oh yes, yes, okay, we've got game audio back. That was unfortunate. That was an unnecessary death. I think he might be mad at us. No, okay, he's going around. So we have the 937 key. That puts us in here. Two, three, four, five. didn't notice. Alright, we lost some time there, but that's fine. I'd rather live. We have to climb through this window, right? That's gonna give us the 909 key. Oh, dang it. There we go. Gonna equip 939 key, rather. Oh! Hi! Come around. Come around to get me. Come on. Do it. Okay. Where'd he go? I think he went the way that we're going, which is really unfortunate for us. Yeah, he did. Did not get killed right now. How far is he going? He's just gunning it, isn't he? Don't get us, don't get us, don't get us. Thank you. Alright, we're good. Gun it. He's chasing us. He's chasing us. That's fine. Not really too concerned about him. 
He didn't notice us either. Okay. It's 939. Starting off strong with the lucky bot here, huh? You punk. Oh, good. That's really bad timing. Are you gonna turn around? That's bad placement. That's really bad placement for us. Lucky bot's gonna come over there as well. Oh no, he's coming up back behind us. That's fine. So we can sprint in here and grab the accoutrement. So we are going to need. I think we need the star wrench first. Could have just been a huge mistake. Did you notice us? No, you did not. Unless you did. No, you did not. Alright, either way, ah, I shouldn't have stopped there. We know there's a safe zone up here. Alright. 930 key. Probably could have added a couple splits between these sections, huh? We definitely needed to add at least a split between these sections. I didn't realize how much we had in between there. Ah, oh, dang it, dang it, dang it. I got too gung-ho. Oh, wasted time. That's what that is. That's nothing but wasted time. It's gonna save our butts to just be patient here. Let all three pass. One, two, let all three pass. Okay. That was totally unnecessary. Let you go. Probably could have made it, but it's not worth it. I did not realize just how much I had in that one split. We'll definitely break that up. I don't really want that nutcracker chasing us down in a second here. So we need to go that way once we have these stones. So we're going to go ahead and wake up the elf. Do we have unlimited stamina on easy mode? I can't tell. I haven't counted properly. <laughs> Don't chase. Thank you. Appreciate you. All the work you've done. Alright. Go and equip this stone. Sprint to the door. I didn't mean to pick that back up. There we go. Grab the key. And the squirt gun. It would definitely be faster for us to not have the squirt gun equipped. But once again, at least for this run, I'm just going to play it safe here. Oh, missed the stairs. Because I'm a fool. Are you coming up these stairs right now? No, thank you. Right, you're right there. Where's the elf? You're right there. That's fine. It does that lucky bot come this way? Because I think he does. We're fine, we're fine. Alright, and 909. 
Wait, 909. There we go. Whew. Okay. All right, all right. I needed to open that door. I panicked. Okay. Oh, we gotta go this way. Ah! Don't forget your pathing. Have I gone the wrong way entirely? No, it's right here. Is there a third one? There we go. One, two. There was a third one. You should turn that way, right? Yep. Woo, that was close. Third one there as well. All right, this guy's gonna come back across, which means I think, <sighs> man, we could rush him, but I don't, I don't want to. It's not worth it. Did he see us? I really hope he didn't. There we go. Star wrench. All right. And elf drop. Skip the cutscene. Please don't give me another audio bug. We're doing good. We're making good time. This is the best run we've ever had. Personal bests all around. Every single one of these is a gold run. <laughs> no, not that way. We want to go this way. I think we need the squirt gun here. I think this is the fire. Wait, where are we going? Oh no. How have I gotten lost? Oh no. Oh, there's a door. Oh, I'm such a rookie. That's fine. That's more time we could save later. That's fine. It's better this way. I'm gonna keep telling myself that indefinitely. <laughs> Alright. Hello, witch. Let me crawl through the tunnel of slowness. Whew! This feels simultaneously really fast and really slow. And that is the only way that I can describe it. I feel like we're making excellent time in the game, but I feel like we could be going way faster. Apparently there was a better way to describe it. All right, Elf Lives is our next spot, and then the Elevator of Doom. You're here, hello. Do I have to talk to your note? No, I do not. Good. All right. Elf lives. Elevator of Doom. I am having a blast. This is really fun. It's also very stressful, but it's really fun. Probably need to waste the time there. All right, witch, start your dialogue. You have been guarding Cavalier. Good, 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 good. Keep talking. <laughs> yes, you have. I really feel like there's a sequence break here. I don't know what it is, but I feel like there is one. Shouldn't need the squirt gun anymore. I prefer to be adventurous. You know the answer to that question. Good. 
still counting. I'm so worried I'm going to accidentally stop the timer. No, I don't. Please tell me. Come on. There we go. And we're in the tunnel. Alright, Elevator of Doom. Here we go. This is probably one of the hardest parts, I think. Because there's a long, a long section here without a checkpoint. If we don't die, it's fine. But that's asking for a lot. Let's get this open. Alright. So this is also a random combo. Okay, maybe not. Maybe it's just easy difficulty. Should have checked that before we did this. Oh, dang it. Oh, man. Time losses everywhere. I think I might need to step into the elevator to get the dialogue right. Yeah. Okay. So we should have a checkpoint there now. I'm a fool. Equip our key. Oh, we are out of stamina. Okay. Good. Good to know. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Is that the witch right there? She's right there. She shouldn't see us from where she is. Alright, she's gonna go upstairs. That's actually good for us because now we can go through that same spot that she was just in. Let that guy hit, and then we go. We need her to get a little bit further. There we go. Okay. Good, 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 good. Whew. Starting to get the stressies. I really shouldn't. This is this is pretty casual, but I'm starting to get the stressies. Alright, so our fair lady can spawn and chase us into this room. So we need to not have that happen, if at all possible. Got the stone. And we're out of stamina, because I miscounted. Seven, eight, nine, ten, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, three, four, five. Thanks, mod. All right, you're here now. That's a problem. That's really unfortunate. Which way are you going to go around to get to me? Which way? Which way? Which way? That way? All right, that's fine for us. We can work with that. Okay. Four, five, six. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Five. Cool. Can't believe that fire was actually coming to get us. That was impressive. He's really going for it. Alright, witch. Where are you gonna spawn? What inconvenient location are you gonna pop into today? Right, literally right next to us. Did anyone else see that? Hacks. Hacks. I guess we will go around. It's a lot slower, but since she literally just spawned, I'm glad there was a grace period because she could have grabbed us with that spawn point. We ran through her arm, basically. But we're okay. 
okay for now. Alright, don't lose count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hit, even though I could have run, I didn't want to. I didn't want to run without stamina, just in case it did catch up to us. Ah, oh, dang it! I miscounted. It's all right. There's no witch behind us. We're okay. Is she gonna spawn in front of us again? All right. Elevator of doom. Activate and elevator of doom. Okay. 35 minutes and 44 seconds to get to almost the finale. Almost. This is this is gonna be a scary part. I'm going to attempt the Muppet skip once. And if I don't get it, if I'm not able to jump over that box on the first try, we'll we'll do the Muppet appropriately. Because I don't want to lose a bunch of time on this run trying to do a trick that we'll probably save. 15 seconds or so. There's a lot of ways that this needs to be optimized. There's a lot of different ways that we can do this better. Like, for example, I'm sure there's a way to go under this elevator. There's got to be a sequence of buttons that I can push that will glitch me through the floor and drop me off at the bottom. That would be a huge time save. Skipping the wait for 2 a.m. would also be a huge time save. Like, there, there are options here. I think this is the cutscene for Krampus, right? We're just going to go ahead and hit escape just in case it is. Oh, okay. There we go. Spinny death, bl death. Spinny death blades. Oh, yeah, that was stupid. That was so stupid. I don't know why I even attempted that. Ugh. That was so unnecessary. That's fun. Oh, that was a really forgiving checkpoint, actually. I appreciate that. That was so stupid. Oh, I crouched. I crouched. Oh, environmental hazards. The bane of my existence. Every time in every game that we play here. Oh. Take this slow. Do it right the first time. Ah, oh, what a fool. Oh, what a goose I am. There's a note on the desk I should probably read. Alright, again, we're gonna try this skip once. We're gonna do this one time. Nailed it. Freaking nailed it. Alright, we need to stop for stamina. Four, five, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You come get me. Come on. Come on now. Come get me. Right, next sprint. Oh gosh. Run over, guys. That's it. This is the end. group. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. This is getting really exciting now. and toys. 
Don't like this one that much, but it shouldn't be that bad. Oh, we gotta wait for this guy. I am so curious if once I start his dialogue, if I reset from checkpoint, if it will skip his dialogue. I'm very, very, very curious. Hey. Hey. and toys. Oh, I have to use the restroom again. I'll try my best. Wow. Come on. Careful with the crampu. Got it. We're good. Please let me through. Please let me through. Please. There we go. All right, where are these nutcrackers? Found him. <laughs> Found both of them immediately. Jerks. Alright. There's definitely a faster way around this Muppet. But we're not going to taunt it right now. Come get me. Come get me. Come on. Good, good Muppet. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Oh, crap. 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 2, 3, 4, 5. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That was close. That was really close. Okay. I believe that is the Muppets and Toys section. Death Blades of Doom. Here we go. I probably shouldn't end Muppets and Toys until I get to this door. Oh gosh. I gotta I just gotta go. I gotta go for it. <sighs> Freaking first try! Holy crap! Oh man. We're speedrunners now. Okay, uh, this is going to be an interesting science -y moment, isn't it? Because we're on easy difficulty now. So I don't know how many of these buttons we have to hit before Krampus and crew actually show up. On normal, it was two. On insane, it was one. What's it going to be here? Once we have an idea, we might use a slightly s slower but safer strategy that worked for us uh, before we did this run. We were doing some tests at the end of the game. All right, on normal difficulty, he and friends would be here now, which means I need the squirt gun. Yep. oh yeah, he's here. All right, we need to make it upstairs. There's Rudolph. Not too concerned with Rudolph. Sees us when we're sleeping. He already forgot about us. Okay, easy difficulty is pretty great. Not gonna lie. Oh, I thought I just ran headfirst into the elf. That was funny. Ah, crapus. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. He got stuck on his own present. There's the elf. Well, this is not exactly going according to plan here, is it? Alright. Three, four, five, six. There's the elf. I don't know where Krampus is. Five, six, seven, eight. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Why do I hear stomping? Don't appreciate your stomping. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There's Rudolph. Come towards us a little bit more, buddy. Ah, oh, dang it. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hate that. One, two, three, four. Oh my gosh, Rudolph, please. Oh, the elf is here too. Good, 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 good. Ooh, you almost glitched towards us, didn't you there, buddy? Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. They might be on us, so this might be... Uh, not good. <laughs> Alright, that's all four buttons down. All we have to do is get down to the bottom and grab the cube. Dang it, Rudolph, please. You're killing us, Smalls. Right, we can get around him now. One, two, three, four, five. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Three, four, five. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, God! Diggity dang it! Please. Okay. 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 Oh! Oh! Ha <laughs> uh. Alright. That's fine. That's fine. Screw you, Krampus. He's over there right now, which is great for us. There's the elf, which is also fine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Rudolph. Pleasure to have you here. Where's the nutcracker? There's no nutcracker here. There's no nutcracker here. There's no nutcracker here. Boom! <laughs> oh, we did it. All right. That was way faster than I anticipated it would be. That was way faster. Awesome, okay. Ooh, GG, good game everybody, well done. Oh, 47 minutes and 39 seconds. 47, 39, that's not bad. That's not bad at all, I'm not mad about that one. Oh, I don't think, yeah, we can't skip this ending apparently. Oh, man. Ah. Good game. Good game, everyone. Ah. That is my first ever live uh, recorded with a timer speedrun that I've ever done. I, I used to play Modern Warfare 2. They had little submissions that had Infinity Ward's best time on them. So, like, you had the time to beat. Uh, on some of them there was an actual time limit and then there was the infinity ward time to beat uh, and a buddy of mine we beat most of those and that is the only other real speed running I mean I ran through halo really quickly a couple times stuff like that really basic stuff never with a timer and never recorded so it has been an honor it has been a pleasure and I am I am grateful that you were here I'm grateful that you watched so Oh. That song was satisfying the first time. It was satisfying the second time. And it's just as satisfying this time. Good game. Did we get caught less than five times? Did we get the stealthy achievement? I don't know because I kept running into traps like a fool. I think with the traps it was more than five times. I don't know if they count the traps. I assume they do. 
It's close. We probably got caught, what, six, maybe seven times with the traps? I guess we'll find out after the credits roll. Oh, man, that's exhilarating. 10 out of 10. I would recommend that you try it yourself. Do a speed run. You won't regret it. Still can't skip. Oh, that was really fun. It's really easy to set up live splits as well. So just go online, download live splits, uh, watch a tutorial. Small Ant has a really good tutorial on setting it up and making it transparent like this. Oh. That was satisfying. What are our stats? What's the in-game timer read? How accurate is it compared to ours? Oh, we gotta finish all the credits first. Ah. Uh. So then my question is, do we leave the credits in when I when I clip the whole run? Obviously the run can't be edited. So do we leave the credits in so that people can see the game time? And I think we do. I think it's going to be annoying. But I want to make sure that everything's kosher and legitimate and there aren't any concerns. So I'll probably leave all of this in. And then we'll see all of us together what our in-game timer is. Because I don't know. This, is, this, this category doesn't exist. At the time that I'm recording this, Krampus' is Home is not a runnable category on any of the sites that I checked. So, we might be speed running into the wind, but we're going to have fun doing it, and I'm going to submit it. I'm going to ask them to make a category. I have no idea how it works. I'll have to look into it, but uh, if you are the mod that is reviewing this, thank you for actually taking the time to sit through it. So, we'll see. We will see if it actually ends up as a category, and if it does, please do your own run, because this can be heavily optimized. Very heavily optimized. For one thing, don't get caught and don't die, and then you'll save time right there uh another thing there's gonna be a way to get past the elevator i i don't know if i'll find it i don't know if anyone will ever find it but i'm sure that there is a way to sequence break many parts of this game well done regal studios i love it oh we got the achievement for stealth master and we got the achievement for speedrunner 45 minutes and one second. Okay. 45 minutes and one second is our in-game time. I wonder how it calculates that because we've got 47 minutes, 39 seconds. I don't know. I don't know how they calculate that, but we were apparently only actually caught by an enemy once. Who caught us? Which one caught us? It was a nutcracker, right? I put myself in a bad spot. I think it was a nutcracker. So dying by traps doesn't count. Whew. What is that speedrunner achievement? What do you have to beat it in? Complete the main campaign in less than one hour. Nice. Nice. Oh, good game. Before, before I step on anyone's toes, actually, let me go to YouTube and just double check that there aren't any speedruns, because I looked, but I only searched briefly. So, let me check. Full walkthrough. Full game. Early access. No commentary. Jump scares. Full walkthrough. Gameplay series. Yeah. So, I don't see any speedruns. On the YouTubes, at least. I know that it's not a category at this point. Yeah. All right, cool. Well, we did it and I had a blast doing it. So thank you so much for watching. I, I really appreciate it and I appreciate you being here. Um, this, was, this was awesome. So I'll definitely be doing this again. This was a great time. Now I have to figure out how to save my split time without deleting it because that's gonna be really disappointing if I do delete it accidentally. Okay, well, I am going to go mess with that, and I hope truly that you have an excellent day.
So thank you.